Looking for a great summer treat? Today we're talking grilled milkshakes and we've got some great fruit in front of us. We've got pineapple, berries, bananas, we've even got some strawberries. And the thing I love about grilled fruit is it pulls some of the sugar out and gives it some amazing flavor. My sister's not a big fan of strawberries, but when they're grilled, she absolutely loves them. So I'm gonna walk you through on how to grill all of these, and then I'm gonna show you how to incorporate those into your next milkshake. Now when you're grilling fruit, berries that are gonna be in the grill basket, those are gonna take about four to five minutes of total cook time. Now when you're grilling your pineapple, you want those sliced about a half inch thick, and those are gonna be about three to four minutes per side. Now bananas, you're gonna to wanna to have those, and they're gonna take about two to three minutes of total cook time. Strawberries are gonna take about four to five minutes on direct heat. Take a look at this grilled fruit. The pineapples have some awesome marking, the strawberries and these bananas are out of this world. This is really gonna provide us some great flavor to our milkshakes. And to give you an idea, when I'm building mine, I like a cup of grilled fruit, two to three scoops of ice cream, and I finish that off with a cup or two of milk. It just depends on the consistency that you're looking for. And to give you an idea, my family's go-to recipe, chocolate ice cream along with grilled bananas. And don't forget to finish them off with some whipped cream, cherries, and some sprinkles. And I hope I've been able to inspire you that the next time you're thinking about something cool and refreshing this summer, you grill your fruit and incorporate that into your next milkshake.